How to vectorize an image in Photoshop. Well, that's what I'm going to show you guys in this super quick and easy tutorial. So if this video has helped you out, please let me know in the comments or simply just leave a like so I actually know that this video has helped you out. So I'm over here inside of Photoshop. I'm just going to use the Roblox logo real quick. So it is actually pretty easy to do. But what we pretty much want to do is simply um, hold control on your keyboard and then select the image over here. So your mouse will get this icon, as you can see. Simply just click on it and this will select your whole layer as you can see. Then what you need to do is make sure to select the rectangular tool. And once you've selected it, you want to right click and then click on uh, make work path. Click on it. And then I'm going to leave the tolerance on one pixels. So click on OK. And now there, it automatically um, pretty much like masked the whole logo, as you can see, uh, just, just to say it like that. So then what we need to do is go to the left and then click the pen tool. Then once you've clicked on the pen tool, we want to right click. And then here we, at the top, we have an option called create vector mask. Simply click on that. And once you've clicked on it, um, here on the right, this will now appear. Simply hit enter on your keyboard. Now all of these um, uh, blue dots have disappeared. So now we have a vector mask, as you can see. Um, so that is actually pretty cool. What you can now do is simply click on free transform and to make it bigger. And as you can see, as you can see, um, when you make it bigger, currently it looks a little bit pixelated, but when you uh, press the check mark button, it is completely smooth out and the quality is still perfectly fine. So you can now do whatever you would like with it because it is a vector mask. In order to actually save this, what you can do is go to file, then to save a copy, and then go to uh, where it says PNG. And then here we have the option called Photoshop EPS. So click on there and then click on save and that will actually save it as a vector instead of a PNG or an image or whatever. So that is pretty much it. That is how to vectorize an image in Photoshop. 